Hello everyone, apologies if I sound a little different today, my throat is sore and I don't know how or why. I just woke up a few hours ago, but I'll continue this commentary regardless. A few days ago, someone had asked me about my opinions on the state of GDYT right now, and I decided to try and peruse the content that the Jump Crew Dash YouTube space has to offer. And man, it it is disappointing. Now, personally, even though I make Geometry Dash content, I don't watch anything related to Geometry Dash other than level showcases and weird but creative idea videos. And sometimes I'll even search through small and unknown GD content creators, and there's a minus skill chance that I'll even leave a comment on some of their videos. Give them a little support, you know. But this time I tried searching Geometry Dash in the YouTube search bar. And the first video that popped up in the results was a Kai Guy video. I decided to click on the filters and search by shorts only, and the first that appeared was a lemon cake video. For many others in the community, these two content creators perfectly sum up just how bad Geometry Dash content in general has become. And there is apparently so much controversy regarding these two that if I tried to tackle the topic here, I would die from a lack of oxygen before I get halfway there. And of course, it's not just those two. There have apparently been so many new content creators abusing the algorithm via the short section that I have not heard about 99% of them even once in my entire lifetime. If I didn't look through the different videos that GDYT had to offer, I'd have no idea they even existed. Maybe I could say the same for myself, but I don't use shorts. I think I've abused the algorithm quite enough, and even though I've faded into obscurity and my content is less than good, at least I can use the earnings to pay for my college fees, and that's what matters. I'm not here telling you to smash the like button. Smash subscribe, smash the notification bell, and smash Vaporeon. My content is essentially just something you can watch for a brief amount of time and then move on. For me, it's perfectly fine for these creators to keep doing as they please. They do what they like doing, and there's nothing inherently wrong with that. But in terms of the content, it's not something I would consider engaging. At least in my opinion. I'm sure a lot of other people do find the opposite to be true, however, given by the views that they get from it, so maybe I just have a completely different standard. And that's fine, you can enjoy things I don't, and vice versa. But would I consider it good content? I think a majority of what is being produced in the Geometry Dash YouTube space is more of meme content than actual content, and the short section is absolutely notorious for abusing the style. Sometimes it feels like I'm watching a TikTok video where you have two halves of the screen displaying two completely different things, which is honestly pretty annoying in my opinion. If you can't go five seconds without having something else distracting you within the video like in a TikTok short, you already have a problem. Some people have already asked me, why don't you use shorts? It gets you more engagement. And while that's true, most of the time, I wouldn't want my content to be mixed up with everyone else's content and be confused as a meme upload. I think the normal style that I utilize right now is already rewarding enough and becoming a shorts creator would be an absolute nightmare to handle. If parallel universes exist, I'm sure the version of me that uses, that uses shorts to upload content is dead. Sometimes I feel like I've already watched something before and that's probably because some of the content is so repetitive and formulaic that it becomes less and less interesting the more I scroll through numerous videos. I cannot even begin to describe just how many similarly crafted wave and cube gameplays I have seen in so many videos. I have only skimmed through shorts once for the sake of this video, but man, I am never doing that ever again. The pain that I feel in my throat right now is more tolerable than watching those kinds of shorts. So generally, I think perception on what good content is varies from person to person, and for me, such content would be a very small minority of the Geometry Dash YouTube space. The majority of videos would be stuff I would never dare click on more than once. Now, whether a content creator is good or not is a completely different topic of discussion, but if you want me to share my opinions on this as well, you can comment down below to let me know. You may also feel free to share your ideas about the Geometry Dash YouTube space. And uh, yeah, that's it. Goodbye.